Hi everyone, it's Leslie at Crescent Moon Journals, and um, I'm here to share the latest little journal that I did. It's um, small, <laughs> but it's chunky, and it's a trifold or kind of an accordion fold journal. So um, it's tied together with sorry, a piece of sorry silk. It's back. I'll take this off so you can really see the. So there's the front. Try and not get the glare. And there's the back. I'm sorry for the glare. It's coming off the mica. And this is a, an old frame from. Um, an old photo album. So opening it up, it's the first page, and we have a photograph of two sisters that was probably taken er, mm, late 30s, 1940 maybe. I know because it's my mom and her sister, so it was probably about that time. And then there's a little reward of merit from an antique scrapbook. And it's tucked into um, an old calling card. And up here's a corner top tuck with, um, I did not make this, but it's really a cute little journaling card. And this is from Sam Pool Designs. We're stitching um, throughout. Here's a belly band and with a tag that I made. Places placed a journal on the back. And here we have a corner pocket with um, garden notes, old journaling card, and this old. Um, piece of ephemera from 1924. Here's another picture from about 19, late 30s or 40s, looks like 40s. And here's a pocket, vellum pocket with a lovely old tin type of a very handsome, I don't know if you can see it, gentleman. This is um, a book, old book page that I printed on. And then I just folded it up and made a pocket on the center. And so these are a group of sisters. Kind of a fun story about them. They used to um, go down to Hollywood and be extras in the movies. This little envelope. with a little uh, Arm & Hammer card. And another little envelope. It came just like this. The back was torn, so I had to put that on it. And it just has uh, some little stamps in there. This is an old letter. Another old reward of merit. Just fold it out. We've got a journaling spot. Same here. You can fold this out. This picture, which is, um, this is 1931. Dad, Bobby, and friend of Dad's home on Palm Street. It just tucks in there. And this is um, a tag you can make from um, oh, a printable that the Graphics Fairy has. 
This is an old photograph that I just put a frame in a cracked piece of mica around to give it more of an age look. Looked look. This is on vellum. Another Sam Pool card and um, an old French letter, which is all tucked in, so I won't open it. Here we, here we have an old, a belly band made from an old scrapbook piece and the Sisters at the Beach. With their cute paper umbrellas. Here's another one. And then an old, um, this is a receipt. I'm trying to see if there's a date. 1856. And they tuck into this little cloth fabric pocket. It's just a little tuck right here with another one of those tiny envelopes with um, a little calling card that actually came in it. I guess I had it like this. It's a fabric pocket again with the tag that I made and another beach scene. And I'll tuck up here with a little like coin envelope with um, just a little piece of antique script. It folds all out. And a little uh, page from an old flower book. And you flip it over and you're ready to go the other direction. So this is a copy of um, photo booth, old photo booth photos. And you open it up, there's another cloth pocket or a tag that I created. And then I made a, a tuck or a, like a belly band, but it's going the other way with the photo booth photos. And this is just a little flip out thing. I did not make this, this was uh, gifted to me or included with something that I purchased a long time ago. And some nice old trim. And we have another tuck here. The crepe paper ruffle. And an old card. And a new card. This is just an old envelope. And a little fabric sample. And over here, oh, this is some lace with a little wax seal. And then this is just a little notepad snippet roll. Um, whatever you want to call it. That you can write on. And it just, you actually could take it out and put something else in here. It just is um, clipped in. And this is an old wedding photo from the 1930s. And a lovely, lovely calling card. Joseph Miller, it says. And here's the center. This is made from an old um, document. It's rag paper. I just made a doily, make two pockets. And these lovely tags were made by um, a friend of mine. 
and they're just beautiful. She does gorgeous work. And here, this looks like it's, I think it says Santa Monica at the bottom, but you can't really see it, which is uh, in California, so the Santa Monica Mountains. And they're on old Harley Davidson, and there's another one back here. And another uh, old French letter. 1871. I'll just put those in later. This is another little Sam Poole tag with it's just a couple of pages from an old um, it's from an old French missile. So they're really thin, thin pages. A little pocket here with another old. This is actually the actual real photo, it's not a copy. And then um, this actually is a copy. And then over here, this is a little slide that um, I got bought from someone ages ago. I can't think which shop it was. It says, tell your story. And there's I made a pocket out of it. So there's a tiny tag. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Tucked in. And this is just a piece of sorry silk with a wax seal. And here we have a little... I've got this tacked down with a little clip because it wants to flip up when you turn the page. So you go like this. And that's another little old photo. And this is, um, this is a, a, an old French seed packet. Went on the seed packet itself and I just made it into a card. I found a bunch of those in an antique mall. And so I just put this little clip down here to keep the lace in place. And there they, they all are out for a family picnic. And back to the front. So this is it. Um, I hope you enjoyed this little flip through. I had a lot of fun making this. And as you can see, it's, I kept going, it was, it's very chunky. So I appreciate everybody who watches and comments <clears throat> and who has subscribed. And I'll see you soon. Bye.